can be difficult to dress, especially uh, for work, I find it. So Debbie Metanopoulos has brought you some cool and colorful ways to brighten up your work look. Well, your work is, look is well, really we're on just point very, today, Christina. We're very colorful and very comfortable this is and true. cool. This is true, yes. because over the summertime, at least for me, I find you really don't know what to wear to work because you want to stay cool, but you also want to be covered and you want to look professional. And you don't want to show too yeah. much skin right. and you want to be comfortable. Right. So I put together a few looks that are going to keep you comfortable, cool, and looking great in the office. Well, let's see. Should we get started? Yes. Our first model is producer Larissa. <laughs> Larissa is wearing this beautiful Pretty. sundress. Aww. Now, I know you're probably thinking a sundress for work, but yes, it is work appropriate. And I'll tell you why. Because the neckline is high and the hemline is perfect. It's below her knee, so it keeps it very ladylike. It's a lighter fabric. And if you still feel like, you know what, this is still too much skin for me because I don't like to show my arms. Right. You can pair it with a fitted blazer, a jean jacket, a cardigan. It's an Adriana Papel dress. It's this Great. lightweight fabric. It still gives you some shape. And you can wear this dress not just to work. I mean, you can wear this straight to dinner. You can wear it to church if you wanted right. to. You Very know what lovely. I mean? <laughs> We've also paired it with a really adorable neutral Soul Society wedge, which goes with a number of, of wardrobe options. You can wear that with even um, ankle pants or or even a short skirt. I We've love all, how flowy it is, Debbie. Isn't very it flowy. nice? It's very flowy. And the fabric is lightweight, which makes yes. it so great for summer. And guess what? You can wear this into the winter or fall, too, because you could throw on a chunky cable knit sweater over it, mm. pair it with ankle boots, and you're good to go. She's also carrying one of those gorgeous test yes. handbags that one of the viewers gets to take home. Ooh, they're so gorgeous. And all of the celebrities are carrying those, and those are Valentino inspired. I know. And you can put everything Every in them. It's so good. Do you like this outfit? I love it. This, I mean, the fact that it's so light and it's so hot here during the day. So if you're sitting in this all day, you're, it's not a problem. And you look beautiful it's great. in it, as oh, always. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you, Larissa. And also, that handbag, by the way, could be a diaper bag, a computer of bag. Of course, it could be a diaper bag, <laughs> Debbie. That's, of course. For me, it's yes, a diaper for bag. You, it's always You'll yes. find a bottle. All right. <laughs> and I'm made of milk. And diapers. All right. Yeah, exactly. And next, we have our very own Laura. Hi, Laura, Laura our other producer. Laura, Hi, Laura is wearing Laura. a jumpsuit. Again, jumpsuits aren't the classic thing you'd think to wear to work. But the reason that this one works is because it has sleeves. Because it has sleeves, it covers up some things. You know, not all jumpsuits are created equal. Some jumpsuits are more of the cat suit look. This is not the look you're going for. No one should wear a cat suit to work. Frankly, no one should wear a cat suit ever, unless you're in 1984. The reason <laughs> this looks beautiful in a bag. This is true. But the reason this also works is because it has a higher neckline than a lot of these jumpsuits that people are wearing. If you still feel like that's too much, put on a tank top. You can also pair that with a fitted blazer. It's really slimming. It's really beautiful. The pattern works. Again, it has pockets and it's loose. It has that beautiful tuxedo stripe down the side. And what we've also paired it with is this beautiful New Rock City jewelry. This is a gate, or agate, excuse me, and druzy. These stones are found in Brazil, and they're a form of quartz. And they're actually more reasonable than most of the big stones you see out there, but they're really dramatic, and they, they make a, a statement. Yes, they're beautiful. How do you feel? I love it. It's so comfortable and chic, and I can wear this out at night. Yes, you yeah, can. Yeah, you, you go right from the studio. Exactly. And go, to drink. go out to drink. So it looks or good. on the weekend, she could roll the pants up and put it on with sneakers, and it or could even be totally casual. To beach. Exactly. Love it. Thank, Thank you, you Laura. Laura. You look beautiful. And finally, yeah. last but not least, I our producer, this. Jill. Do you love this? It's like a throwback to the 50s. I love it. As a matter of fact, you are exactly oh, right. Really? Okay. Yes. This skirt made its debut in the late 40s, early 50s. It's Gorgeous. called the midi skirt because it hits you at the middle of your calf. Right. Right. We also paired it with a really cute Soul Society neutral kitten heel with a little scalloped strap. The reason this skirt works and it's not too dressy is because we put it with a white t-shirt. I love the fact that you used a t-shirt. Yes, that is because cool. you look at the skirt and you think, oh, this is for a cocktail party. Right. It's for something right. dressy. But no. It's, more not. Contempor it's contemporary. It's contemporary. You put it with a white t-shirt and although this fabric is heavier, it's a heavy fabric that feels like it would be for mm -hmm. fall or winter. Not with this t-shirt. But you could wear it with a black t-shirt with a cable knit sweater and wear it with a little booty and some tights and then it becomes a winter outfit. Really nice. Do you it's, like it, Jill? I feel like it's the most versatile piece you could own because you can, just like you said, a tank top and a jean jacket in the day for work or for a black tie event. Honestly, you could dress it up with fancier pumps and you're good to go. I love it. It's love very it. Sarah Jessica Parker. Oh, it, it, I love that comparison. What about the jewelry? <laughs> the jewelry is beautiful too. The jewelry is model's own. Model's own. <laughs> okay. model's Thank you, Jill. Okay. You both come out. You. Please come out. Let's talk about these beautiful, and you guys look fantastic. Okay. Let's talk about uh, all of the accessories here. Well, if you feel like you don't want to in, um, invest in a full outfit 
for summer. Something that will really give you your outfits what, what you've had for a long time, some pop, and make them new again. These jewels that Laura was actually modeling, they're from New Rock City. And it's spelled R-O-X-I-T-Y, NewRockCity.com. They're called the Boss Lady. They're agate oh, and they're druzy and they're really beautiful. And the Soul Society shoes, they start at $35 from SoulSociety.com. They have great shoes. Great shoes, lots of different prices. And this bag is really, really, this is the piece de resistance that one of our viewers is going home with. So it's beautiful, and then there's one for you. All right, <laughs> one for you. Yes, one lucky viewer will get the chance to take home this gorgeous work tote, which retails for two hundred twenty-five dollars for free. All you have to do is follow us on Twitter and retweet our tweet with the hashtag hashtag Tess Bag. There you go. Look how great they look. All the oh, guys look like very. <laughs> all right, next we're going to go to Maria Provenzano. What do you have for us today, Miss Gold? When we come back, I'm going to show you how to strike gold on a budget. You won't want to miss it.